I'm probably ambitious because I am creative, I think, mm -hmm. and I think that I have this desire to create things, and I think being creative, you have to be slight, you have to be ambitious because you have to put yourself out there, right? Um, and it's very personal, and it's it's hard. So, yeah. So, have you always been creative? Is this this part of how you operate as a creative person? You think it's quite innate to who you are? I think so. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. My dad was actually quite entrepreneurial too, so he right. had his own companies and. I think that's, so I have a company, and I right. think that was part of the reason, just seeing his, him and his journey and his success sort of show, showed me that it was more, you know, there's more paths out there than just your typical right. kind of get a job, Do work what someone else, else does. <laughs> right. buy a house, yeah. retire. I actually have a, a good friend who's also a business partner who owns a company, she's been operating it now for four years, four and a bit years, and she's grown it to be... 30 people right big and she is incredible she wants to go global with this company and she just has it seems like her dreams are just there's no tap right there's no filter they just, right she's just she's just very incredibly ambitious big so dreamer it's got to be her for sure okay great now I'm going to ask is there anything that would enable you to be more ambitious or do you feel happy with where you're at now I think it's my biggest barriers are sort of are internal ones so right probably being more confident and maybe not letting the weight of stress okay. kind of like weigh me down. Yeah, that okay. mostly internal things would, would if those were lifted, right. that would help.